nameless here. I feel like Poe staring out through a window, listening for something that hasn't been heard. Deep in the heart, whose beat just occurred, he leaps through the brain to the tongue, where words are to thoughts like shadows are formed from the spinning light of the sun. The echo of echoes reverberant now, the fin and feather, the sword and plough. Whatever I felt lit on my skin as time moved in and then out again, and I was diminished by depth and dimension, the point where space finished its ended intention, barrier islands where waves wash out in the wind. How can a void be independent of nothing that is something that does exactly the thing that it can't? It exists intermittent as dawn and day, dusk in the night. This second an instant asserts as a thing found in the gist of an inkling. I can't even think until it's alive, animate, born metaphysic, melodic, rhythmic, with high heat moving in straight waves, brilliant, hot, like fingers entwined in a new love. Sound and light enter a union waves that rise to the sun. Noise isn't white, but is everywhere. Music is here where light reappears, having rounded the circles of space, having traveled from there, direct or diffuse in nascent air that floats in the drifts that it rides, riddled by wind, baffled by tides. When music was charged with light, it was then when I heard the wind, that master of mysteries, firefly by firelight, flickers in reveries, musics that chant and enchant, as light finds its chords in the intimate rhythms of words. What could change nothing to something? If sounds conjugate in a void, if layers of light years collide in effusions in melodies, the singing songs tell of enchantments, histories, where something of nothing belongs, unexplained image from sound that never was lost, once found. Shattered in some, now frozen together, heat melts us into a flow. Depths are pooled from the quick of shallows, each as the other, both as each shadow, a leaf and branch in the river, an echo sown into an echo, with beautiful nothings to know. Things become what they seem, a wash in the wake of a dream. Wanders me here where I evanesce, born in the nature of things, where love is a centering, radiance glistens and spins, whether or not there is presence to hear what is near or to listen, the things on the wing to their essence, the movement of clouds in a windstorm, the veils of rain waiting to come. Narrow me down to the ends of immersion, to re-emerge widened as space is in light, as silver or gold as sun shafts in night that stream to the edge of the present, to disappear once again in the spinning sound of a planet making its waves a wind, whether descend or ascend, if to begin or to end. So blow me away in the tides of the wind, the taste that I have is bitter and sweet, the nothing I know is full and complete. I know now the depths of your arms, the scent of your warmth encircled, wrists round my neck, bangled charms, and Saturn's rings sing as they were, mountain top, temple bell clear, of love nevermore, nameless here.